this is how good the tips are. It practically makes your opponents leave the match. Welcome to the kingdom of awesomeness. It's me King Awesome and today we have the Ice Wizard Draft Challenge. And also we are gonna talk about the season 13 a bit. I mean like or tell me basically tell me what your thoughts are down in the comments. I think it's pretty good. It's basically the shipwrecked arena but without the wreckage I guess. I mean it's pretty beautiful. We'll just check it out in a, in the next in a in a couple of seconds. It's quite vibrant I guess and stuff like that. Yeah. And now here are the five tips that I have for the Ice Wizard Draft Challenge. Which will be coming up on the screen right about now. Tip number one, always make sure to pick a win condition. Tip number two, always choose the counter. Tip number three, always put up a good defense and avoid rushing. Tip number four, try to pick the royal recruits and never the elixir golem. Tip number five, pick high damage spells. It's basically the same thing guys uh, from my previous video from the dra uh, Dark Prince draft challenge because it is the same thing right except for the ice wizard except for the fact that you're gonna win an ice wizard. It's the same thing. You, I would highly recommend you go check that. You go check out my previous video because I go in in depth, uh, discussion about these tips. The video's uh, link will be in the description as well as the card on your top right side. Now, without further ado, let's get into the couple of matches. Okay, let's see. It's quite not wrong here because you can basically pick anything. But I'm gonna pick this card because there's gonna be a lot more. And now, I'm gonna take this zap. Even though it won't take them out, but I think I should have taken the zap as well. Zap only. <clears throat> now, let's take the uh, heal spirit. <clears throat> okay, let's go. Yeah, I gave him the elixir golem, which is a good thing, I would say. But I gave him the poison, which is certainly a bad thing. Okay, let's do the princess. And let's do the knight. Alright, so he basically got fire character for the princess. So let's go for King Tower activation. Let's do that and hopefully the fire character will be no more. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's do uh, this thing on that side. Let's go in with a nice spirit. And kaboom, that's very really good. Alright, I didn't see the left side crop. Let's go with the princess. <clears throat> I don't know what just happened to my voice. It's not very good right now. Okay, I should have played the knight over there. But never mind. Let's do that and let's do that as well. And I certainly should have waited. And kaboom, that was so good. <clears throat> Pardon me, I don't know what's up with my voice right now. <clears throat> Let's play a princess in the opposite lane. So we basically got a, quite a fast cycle deck, I would say. Let's go with an ice build in the tank for the. Yep, exactly what I wanted. Let's go with that. Let's also go with nothing. Let's just go with this thing and this thing. That should be tower right there. He has nothing to defend against all of that. Great. This deck is such a cycle deck to be honest with you. I literally have no card that goes above 4 elixir. Above 5 elixir. Or oh, not even 4 elixir this second. Yeah. Yeah I didn't play my card because I knew he was gonna be doing that. Let's do this and we miss that thing. Never mind. Let's zap Zamora. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> Let's go with this. Let's also go with a barrel on top of everything. Then let's go with a heat spirit. I don't exactly know why, but we're gonna do it anyways. And I zap that. Why does that did not work? Let's get that elixir real quick. Let's tank for the tower with that. Let's play this. Let's play that. Let's also play a heal spirit. Which died and we get the tower. 
perfectly perfect guy let me go i was surprised that i literally built such a fast cycle like and there was basically no card that was above five elixir in the whole like the, in the whole exchange in so there we go This is how good the tips are. It practically makes your opponents leave the match.
and there we go guys we completed the challenge with just a single loss yeah i had to cut it whatever i promise that if you follow all of these tips you will certainly win the challenge and yeah go check out my previous video for the dark Prince draft challenge so that you can get an in-depth view of the all of these tips and i promise that not just it's not just for the ice wizard ice wizard draft or any or dark prince it is for any other draft that might come your way you'll certainly win with the help of those tips hit that like button if you like the video subscribe for more awesomeness